Hello, the internet. It is Sunday, the 25th of July, 2021, and welcome back to the channel. And welcome back to day 25 of July. What is July? Well, good question. For the last 25 days and for the next four till the end of the month of July, I will be live every day here on YouTube. Take the word July, take the word live, merge those suckers together and you get July. Every day for the month, right here on YouTube streaming, as well as my regulation streams over on the DLive machine. It's nice to have you here. Yesterday, we spoke a little about the Olympics and skateboarding and my history with skateboarding. And then we got into a converse. Oh, side note, the whole stream got taken down because we used the Olympic we watched that video of the skateboarding, uh, a look at how skateboarding works on the uh, in the Olympics, and that banned my video globally. So what I'm doing now is I'm trimming out the sections where we played those clips from from the Olympic website or from the Seven News Seven Sports website. Isn't that strange? It's a global game, but yet if you're a YouTube commentator, you cannot commentate and have that up. So I'm just trimming it out, but YouTube take forever to do that. But if you're looking for that for that live stream rerun, it's no longer there until the trimming happens. We were talking about skateboarding. We were talking about the somehow we got onto cricket and we got onto my old neighbor uh, John Dyson, and we got onto how he wouldn't allow me to have a skateboard ramp. And I told you I had photographs of the skateboard ramp. I dug up from under my bed, a uh, shoebox, literally of old photos. And I thought it would be fun to have a look at that photograph and then maybe dig through this thing and look what else is in here. Because I haven't opened this up in a long time. I took it outside and dusted it off. It was completely dusty. There's probably some pretty, well, there'll be some photos of, uh, you know, ex-girlfriends and whatnot in here which might be a little dubious so i'll have to go and be a little uh stealth with my i was gonna say scanning i'm not maybe i should scan these suckers at some point yes i have an old printer that has a scanner maybe maybe i should be scanning these at my own leisure but today i figured we'd look through them and have a bit of a giggle right a bit of a giggle hello the internet i began the chat and there's david good morning david how are you doing man i'll give you a little Little cheesy cheese. Hendrick's in the house. Hello, the internet. Hello, Hendrick. How you doing, man? By the way, my chat doesn't want to work now. Let me see if that's working. I'm live. Does it say smash that like button? Grimsky's in the house. What's up, Grim? How you doing, man? Dude, we don't see you on the tubes of you. I just put a chat message in. Nope, didn't work. Okay, the chat doesn't work again for me. Oh, no, there it is. Smash that like button. All right, that's working. Yeah. Well, folks, here is the chisel chat so we can all play along together. Um, the only way that I figured to do this would be to use an NDI source, as we've done before with coins. So let me, let me, I guess let me get this kind of set up here. I'm going to use, I'm going to use my iPad because it has a great camera on it. So I'm using the Epoch NDI source. And if I crank that on in an ideal world, in an ideal world, this will be, be here. here. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay cool, cool, cool. Okay, okay so, so first, first of all, is, is the, the audio, audio still good? good? We're, we're, just, we're just using the NDI vision. vision. Do, you Do you want wide, wide vision, vision, such as, such as like, this? like this? We put, we put this, this down, down here. here. By the way, here's, By the, way, here's the, the first photograph of the skateboard, the skateboard ramp. ramp. Do you want, Do you want wide, wide vision, vision like, like this? Or Do you want more of a... Straight on vision. I guess straight on for a photo, right? You don't need wide. So there, so there, 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 this yeah, is this is going to work. So there, so there is, is, if I can hold, if I can it, hold still, it still, that's the, that's ramp. the ramp. That's funny, that's funny hey. hey. That's myself, that's myself uh, with, uh, a with a forehead slap. slap. There's an echo. There's an echo. Okay, okay, an echo. An echo. Cool, 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 cool. Thanks, Henry. Thanks, Henry. Um, um, let me just let take me a look at that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. That should have fixed it. Sorry, sorry about that. I um, 
I neglected to think that the NDI source would bring in audio as well. Yeah, cool. So now it should be gone. So double the audio. Thanks, Grim. Thanks, guys. I didn't look at the chat, even though it's right there on the screen next to me. Um, so yeah, here here is this, the ramp that John Dyson would not let me have. So what you can see in this photo is the property behind is John Dyson's. And this is obviously the property that that we owned. And you can see the tiered level, The like I was saying before, how here it drops off about seven feet down to another level. So even if this ramp did get finished, which look how sketchy it is. Look how sketchy it is. It would have been kinked as all crap. It, it, it would have been a, a lousy ramp, right? I'm, I'm kind of glad we never went ahead with this. That's as far as we got and John Dyson made us pull it down. So yeah, that's, that's pretty lousy. That's what it would have been. That's a haggard looking ramp, dude. It, 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 we we did it the way we thought we were we should do it. I mean, obviously, obviously we were pretty much uh, new to the whole building ramp games. Although that was one of our later ones, but so I don't know what's in here. I mean, I know what's in these albums. These are like oh, there's New Zealand in here, by the way, Grim. I got photos of New Zealand in here. Check this out, New Zealand Times. Um, me at the bottom of Ben Lomond Walk in uh, Queenstown, getting ready for a vlog back in 2000. On top of, uh, I guess that's Coronet. No, looking, that'd be the Remarkables, top of the remarks. Um, what else have we got in here? Oh yeah, shooting some, shooting some close-ups here of the old icicles. Got to dig up all that old footage too. What else is in here? Do you want Do you want to see ex-girlfriends? I don't know if you want to see ex-girlfriends. Oh, you've already seen Shelby anyway. You're just a baby there. I'm, 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 I was a baby, man. I was a baby. We've, we've, we've all seen Shelby. I don't know if you want to see. Look. <laughs> Look how unhappy she looks here. Let me show you this. Look how unhappy she looks. Yeah, this sucks living in New Zealand. It's a terrible place to live. <laughs> Hate it. I was loving it. She was hating it. My first Steve-Ann, or actually, it was my second Steve-Ann, I think. Can't remember when this came in, but the, yeah. That's my my first attempt at Steve Ann. Mitsubishi L300. That's me eating my shoe. That was awesome living in that thing. Traveled the whole South Island. Yeah, look, not happy, huh? Not happy. Check this out. It really sucks parked up in some beautiful place having to eat out of a bowl. It's terrible. She hated it. She hated it. Ah, oh, crikey. No, you don't want to see this. Dang. Um, oh, and now we skip forward to Australia with another Steve Van version. Check Steve Van out here. That one there was a rad van. By the way, these are, these are now uh, like getting later in terms of um, time frames. Steve Van, an early, an early version of Steve Van. Byron Bay. Looking for levels here, Hendrik. Trying to get this level. Check this out. Are we level? Am I level there? Trying to get a shot on the beach with a beer and a tripod. Are we level? Are we level? Classic. Steve Ann. Oh, here's a, a, oh, cool. Maddie. Check this. Look how young I look here. With this is Maddie, uh, ex-girlfriend. Check this out. Look how young we both look. I mean, I, I don't know what she looks like these days, but I'm assuming older. <laughs> and matey, Maddie and matey. <laughs> Classic. Classic. Jamming, dude. These these ones here. 
Got bogged. Damn, there's heaps of stuff in here you don't want to see. Crikey. So, inside loose photos. So all your Steve Vans were Mitsubishis. Yeah, Henrik, they have been. I, that's that's kind of... um. That's coincidental more than anything. Oh, wow. Tracer Tours. Some Tracer stuff in here, folks. I didn't, I didn't even know I put this in here. Oh, these were... That's right. These were postcards. These were postcards you could buy on tour that I made. Oh, I've got the NDI. This was a postcard you could buy on tour that I made that people bought and helped support me on the road. So this was literally a postcard that I would then mail to you from wherever you like if you bought if you bought these I'd then mail them to you from the road. So there's that one, then there was also I think there's two versions. No. No, there is. There's one. Yeah, that you could either buy the tracer one or you could buy my hideous head. This one. I don't know why you'd want a postcard like that. <laughs> but that was the idea. Literally a postcard, which I'd then pop in the mail for, for anybody who bought it. And these are the leftovers. Oh, there's also some... Um, Rock Cafe in St. Paul. St. Pauli Tracer. Oh, yeah, I, I used to keep all this stuff, eh? Like, these are all the... um. I kept these because these include my photographs. And this is like a, a playbill from... Somewhere, I guess Germany, St. Pauli, Rock Cafe, St. Pauli, and there's Tracer at the at the bottom there. That's my photograph. That's why I kept all this kind of stuff just for my own posterity, I suppose. What else have we got in here? Birthday cards. Dude, where the hell was this? This is a club called Stay Negative. Check this out. Stay Negative. Alternative rock metal tracer after party. I don't, I don't know where that was. Stay Negative. It's a funny, it's funny that it's Stay Negative, right? Classic. Let's get that out of there. Some old stickers here. Some old Gives a Minute stickers. Wow. Whole bunch of old gives a minute stickers. Some chewing gum? What? <laughs> there's some gum in here. When you, whenever you need a fresh breath of freshness, there's gum in this photo album from yesteryear. Oh, here's my here's my year ten formal date. <laughs> Get ready for this. Get ready for this. This is hideous. <laughs> Someone, nobody told me my hair was. Oh my goodness. Let me show you this. My year 10 formal date. How come nobody said, dude, fix your hair? Look at that little little bit of hair at the top. That's Karen Ratcliffe. She's cute too. Karen. Yeah, Karen, right? Kaza. Classic. Um... Well, there's my first girlfriend. Whoops. Linda. This is this is um, obviously Sydney Harbour. On a ferry, I guess. Shit. Yeah. Funny. She uh, does not look anything like that anymore, and I guess I neither do I. Dude, there are so many old. I don't know if we want to go through all this crap. I don't, I don't want to see some of this stuff. Skateboarding, most of it's skateboarding. Actually, all of it's skateboarding. Oh, here's another shot of that ramp. This is another shot of that ramp. Yeah, looking... Oh, we, yeah, we... Okay, so we did surface it eventually. Check this out. I can't recall that, but we didn't ride it. But that's... That's the other side. Looking a little, it looks like a little better there, yeah? A little more rideable. Still never quite got fully rideable. 
You love looking through. You love looking through old photos. But this, I mean, this is going to be pretty tedious for you, Yahoos, right? Wow. There's an old photo of me at a wedding. Oh, here, here's me, uh, dudes. Look at the way Karen is looking at me in this group photo. This is me and my friend Gunya. Greg Hinks and his date, Rochelle Hubbard, and my date, Karen. Look at the way she, I was just doing something stupid and she's looking at me like, am I really taking this guy to the formal? That's probably what she was thinking right there. What am I doing? Look at this one. This is a, a strange one. This is at a wedding. Looking pretty styling there, if I do say so myself. That was at Chris's wedding back in the day. Guess there's more old school. I, I gotta scan all this crap, I guess, because these are these are all gonna corrode, right? Most, m like, nearly all of this is skateboarding. Oh, here's Tim Cook's ramp. Check this out. This is up in uh, Engadine. Tim Cook had a had a ramp. That was a good ramp for a backyard ramp. Tim Cook couldn't skate it. So we did. He was. He was. I don't even. I don't even know why he had it. He wasn't a skateboarder. Ah, oh, St. Mary's. Look at this. Obviously bailing something. St. Mary's skate park. Yeah. Wow. Bondi. Oh, this was Mob's ramp. Mob's mini ramp we built up the back of Mob's house. That was sick. Triple M Rock Sydney. See the Triple M sticker? Hendrik, you'll remember those. That ramp looked really narrow. Yeah. We, we, we never had a hell of a lot of space. Or well, Tim didn't either, but definitely on the narrow side. Oh, here's an early, early, early photo of me surfing. I, the only problem with this photo... By the way, that's just down the road here. The only problem with that is uh, Dad, in his infinite wisdom, waited for me to get all the way into shore. I, I literally, like, you can see the dudes at the back. That's where the waves were starting, and that's where we were. And Dad waited till we got all the way to shore. Actually, that's not, that's not, sorry, that is not Myola. That's Molly Mook. Look at the color of the sand. Myola is white sand. That's Molly Mook. For the, and you can see there's a little bit of headland at the back there. That's Molly Mook. <laughs> And I remember, I remember I was so cut when, when that photo came back from the developer. I was like, Dad, how come you didn't zoom in? Why did you take that? That's such a bad photo. Yeah, I had those stickers, Triple M Rocks Brisbane. Hey, here's, a, here's someone you may have heard uh, in the skateboarding world. This is Jake Brown at our... This is the, this is the best ramp that we built in the Shire. Um, you don't really see it from this shot, obviously, because it's just one particular shot. But that's Jake Brown doing a... I think he's doing a late flip over the hip. And let me tell you, even back... That was like... What, what was that? I would have been in year 11. That would, that would have been 1992. And even in 1992, Jake Brown was absolute ripper. Like he... And and see the see behind where the ramp is. See see those two dudes sitting on the under the tree in that bushland just back there, like behind those trees. They'd all like Jake and all the, those crew would go and smoke pot, and and then they'd come out, and even like after sucking down bongs, he would blaze that thing. Like that guy, and you've seen him on the X Games and crap. He he just just like naturally gifted at skateboarding naturally gifted wow some stuff in here that uh, not even I want to pull up for sure they're all stuck together too like over the years they've all aged yeah this is that same ramp um Grimsky, this is that. This is Tim's ramp. How narrow it is! But even back then, in the, in the day, that was kind of like that was amazing to see a ramp that big, right? Like in someone's yard. That was like an I guess that's a seven and a half, eight foot 
mini ramp. Just to even have that in a yard was like huge. Fairfield. Huh. Huh. Me at school. Don't want to see that crap. Oh, some of these are all bent too. I should have done this ages ago. There's one there now. Grimsky, I wish I had a skate park in my hometown when I was growing up. I wouldn't have gotten into so much trouble. What 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 hometown was that? Where, where were you brought up there, Grimsky? Oh, I've got an old ticket. I've got an old rail ticket here from Perth. I think this is from Subiaco. Yeah, this is the, the third of the first. So the third day of the year, 1996. This ticket is two sections from Subiaco. Two sections. Have a... You don't have to guess, but I'll tell you. This ticket cost 80 cents. Valid until 12.48 p.m. Subiaco, two sections. That'll cost you 80. That'll cost you less than a dollar, dude. Imagine that these days. Imagine. I don't even know why I've still got that, but imagine a train. Imagine getting a train ticket. Oh, here's Hugen van Dugen van Schnugen. This is Pete Oste. He was a ripper, too. That's the Waterloo um, Just Avert mini ramp, if you like. Hugen could go frontside, but couldn't go backside. I never ever saw Hugen do a backside air in his whole life, but he could blast six foot frontside airs and frontside ollies, but couldn't go backside on an air. He could do backside ollies though, but not a backside air. Here's me on the same ramp, uh, rock and roll. That was fun, that ramp. Those sessions were cool. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. St. Mary's. Mary's Bondi Fairfield dude I'm sure I'm sure this guy Greg I, I'm friends with him on Facebook these days I'm sure he'd love to see that that's him blasting the backside tail grab at Fairfield he'd love to see that I should I should scan I should scan all this stuff and send it to him that is it's like a lucky dip here hey like you pull up like <laughs> look how skinny I am here oh wow this is narrow check this out look how thin I am on this one I went through a real um, uh, um, like I wouldn't I wouldn't say I was unhealthy but I was definitely just skateboarding way too much and not doing anything else and then if you just just drink slurpees and skateboard you just you just, you just don't grow right i was just burning all my any any fuel i put into my body i just burnt through skateboarding now this is intriguing this is this is a vert ramp in Nowra, which is no longer here but i know exactly where that spot is and that even that fence is not even there anymore that place isn't even there anymore that's intriguing some snorkeling stuff here perth Perth. Wow, dudes. Bondi. That's all. Dude, how much more is in here? There's quite a fair bit in here. What's this? Birthday cards. Oh, here's me shucking down some stairs. This is probably... what? What's that? One, two, three, four, five, six. A seven set. That's pro probably the biggest set of stairs. Hey, that's stuck on there. Get off there. That's probably the biggest set of stairs that I could shuck down back in the day. A seven set. Maybe. Yeah. I oh, that's Loftus. I was just trying to work out where that is. There might have been a bigger set that I did in, um, in Cogra, I think. I don't know. I don't know. Either way, <laughs> that's why my feet are so screwed up these days. Can't be doing that and expect to live a healthy life with. Look at this. This is beautiful, right? Why? You lived in a little farming village in Taranaki called Okato. Oh, wow. Look at this. How sick is just that scene? That's on Bondi Beach. 
Uh, forget the, the the poop scooter on the ramp, but look at that. Look how just a beautiful mini ramp on the beach. Just a straight up two side mini ramp. That's what we need right on Bondi Beach. And they got rid of it. And now it's a bowl. I would rather have, and there was a vert ramp there too. I'd rather have um, a mini ramp any day than a bowl. Here's, um, I guess this is probably the, the why is it so jumpy now? It's, that's me on a handrail, but that's a nose slide. I found those easier to get to because you didn't have to, you didn't have to ollie over the the height of the rail. You could ollie and smash into the rail. So you, it was a bit of a cheat, right, to do a to do a nose slide. I found them much easier than than actual board slides at the start, anyway. But then could get down on, onto them. Dude, you want to see a skinny me here? Holy crap. This is St. Mary's Skate Park. Why is it so laggy now? Look at that. Look at Gav freaked out on the platform too. He's like, he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna flick that off at me. Yeah, St. Mary's Skate Park. Let's go through these quicker, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna scan this stuff myself. Oh, here's the day that I left home. Look at this, the day that I left home. That's my farewell. That's my brother, my sister, and two fostered kids we had, Bill and Roz. That's the day I left home. Got I literally got in my car after this photo was taken and drove from Sydney to Perth. That was when I left home. Oh yeah. Oh shit yeah. I should put this on my wall. This was a photo that made the newspaper the ramp I was telling you about before that we built in the Shire, the best the best mini ramp we ever had. Um, so there was a big kerfuffle, like the council was going to knock it down and blah, blah, blah. And so we organized the local paper to come down and run a story on it. And they brought a photographer and this one here, I, I, I can't recall if it was front of the, I don't have the clipping from the paper, but that was definitely ran in the paper. And yeah, I managed to get a, a nice print of it. That's a melancholy to fakey on the extension. And what you can't really see, kind of where my thumb is, I guess, if you keep looking down, that's on the edge. Not an edge, but it was another four foot drop below. So this extension would have been, I guess the mini ramp would have been four foot, then the extension would have been another foot, five foot. So the, so from the coping to the ground would have been maybe about nine feet. And it was it was only like two two to three feet wide, that extension. So that was on the on the very edge of it. But that's what I could do on it. But Jake Brown was just all over that thing. Dude, I don't even, I don't, I don't even, I'm scared. I'm scared of these. Like there's a photo here of a chick I don't even want to look at. I don't know. I don't want to do all this. <laughs> now that I get deeper into this, I feel like these are best left. Some of these are best left stuck together. Bit frightening. Wow. I mean, it's good to have these memories, but the idea of this was to show you the ramp that John Dyson never let me have, and I guess we've done that. So maybe I should just put these away. And if I'm going to do something with them, I mean, there's, dude. Oh, here's another one at the um, at the hip ramp. What the hell? Okay, I'll show you two more. It's just because they're because they're funny. I'll show you two more, and oh no, I'll show you three more. No, no, that's no, no. Leave her alone. I'll show you two two more and that'll and then if then I'll scan I'll I probably won't start scanning it today, but this is the same hip ramp. This is a good shot of the Okay, so I remember this 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 photo session. I got some some of my sickest tricks on that hip. I remember getting backside tail grabs over that hip. As you can see there, that's a melancholy. Uh Ollie to fakies, front side Ollies. And then I gave there was a rad photo of me on the like taken from the hip, looking towards the hip, so you could see both both copings, both hips. <clears throat> there was a sun going down behind it. 
was perfectly exposed. Someone, I can't even recall who shot it, had flash, big tweaked out melancholy. And I gave it to Linda, my ex-girlfriend, and she blew it up and put it on a wall and never gave me the original back. And I always, after we broke up, I asked her, I was, can I get those photos back? And she said, no, I threw them out. The only ones, like, no, I don't even remember who shot them. That's, that kills me, huh? But here's the last one I'll show you. This is just me as a, as like an eight-year-old or something, just at a birthday, probably my birthday, I guess. Look. <laughs> Yeah, that's my birthday. That's Mob in the background picking his nose. And David Lee. I had Mob and David Lee at my birthday party. And that's my brother, Stefan, and my sister just out of frame. Yeah. Classic. Classic. I mean, that's... I guess that's pretty much all I wanted. I, I mean, I really, really only wanted to show you the ramp that got... That never got made, this guy here. And we did... We looked at all that. But then I got sort of nostalgic here and dug in a little I will I will scan all this at some time and I don't know whether I'll what's the process to scan and share that crap is there even is that even a thing can you I don't know I don't know I could guess I could put them on Facebook but does anybody have anything Raven of the Shadows hello Raven wow so cool I'm sorry I, I was kind of I was kind of neglecting the chat here I was just getting a little little carried away by nostalgia I did see some old ex-girlfriends that were I guess it sort of makes you stop and go okay yeah cool I'm getting a little emotional here not gonna lie it's early on a Sunday man it's super windy too like it's blowing an absolute gale out there there'll be no surfing it's supposed to be a meter and a meter and three 1.3 meters swell and I went out this morning and had a look it's as flat as anything there's no meter swell at all and there's blowing it's going to be gale force winds by midday from the west, so offshore, but it's great if it's offshore, but there's got to be a bit of swell as well. There's no swell. So it's going to be one of those days. Might watch some of the Olympics, catch up on the Olympics. Um, otherwise, I mean, we'll be doing a cap game in Kong's 10 Songs Volume 41. Did I give you my DLive link? I don't think I did. I've got that here, folks. I'm on DLive. Not right now, but I am on DLive. I put a little linky poop in the chisel chat if you want to come and join the DLive machine later on. I'd appreciate to see you there. Is that going to work for me? Tell me it's going to work. Tell me the link comes up. It's pretty slow. If it does. There it does. Okay, it does work. It just takes a long time. So if you want to join me on the DLive machine later on for a Kong's 10 Songs Volume 42 or 41, can't recall, uh, and a really beautiful homebrew. Holy crap. The homebrew I've made, we had one for the first time last night on DLive. It is really, really good. It's a golden ale, and I used malt extract in addition to beer improver. The beer improver is in place of dextrose, so it's, it's a form of sugar. I'm doing that every time from now on. That was so tasty. I got I got 29 of them left to drink, so I'll drink one tonight. I'll see you over on DLive. Thanks for... Um, thanks for... Uh, humoring me on this sort of nostalgic journey. I know photos aren't for everybody and I probably won't do this again, but it was interesting to have a look at. Uh, if you've got any suggestions of things you want to talk about on these streams, there's only like five more days of July left. So five more days of YouTube streaming. And then we go back to regular broadcasts once a week on the tubes of you live, but daily on DLive. So if you've got anything you want to chat about, you know, hit me up in Discord or here in the chat. Uh, once we finish the stream. Otherwise, take it easy. Have a great day. Enjoy your weekends. And I'll see you all next time. Who said that? See you on DLive if I wake up in time. You're going to go to bed now, Hendrik? Okay. Well, I'll see you over there later on then, maybe. Cheers, man. Now. <laughs>